In this video, I am going to take you to a Miami City Park known as Historic Virginia Key Beach Park, which is located on its namesake island of Virginia Key. We arrived in the early afternoon and were immediately greeted by a quick and sharp thunderstorm that swept over the park. Needless to say, this thunderstorm kind of set the tone for the rest of the day. It is not that there are not a lot of things to do, it is that the park was relatively busy for a weekend, which was when we visited. The beach was also relatively narrow, considering that it was located in Miami, but that is because Virginia Key is located next to Bear Cut, which is the channel that separates Virginia Key from Key Biscayne. Other than the beach, there were also a few attractions for visitors to enjoy, such as the visitor center, which is closed on weekends, a carousel which was closed on the day I visited and a model railway which was also closed when I visited. I had no idea whether this was because of the pandemic or whether they were closed by default at weekends. To the north of the park lies a garden showing the history of Virginia Key as well as some more landscaped areas. At the southern entrance of the park though lies a curiously tall sculpture. After doing a little bit of online research though, I found out that this is what currently remains of a sculpture which in 2015 became the world's tallest sandcastle. So overall, I had a very interesting experience at historic Virginia Key Beach Park. My day there probably would have been better if I had travelled there during midweek. But regardless, it was a new place to try out in Miami.